Good afternoon. It is May 21st. It's about lunchtime, but I wanted to show you guys a little healthy combo of food that I've been eating for breakfast. It is lunchtime, but it's super good, really light, but packed with lots of antioxidants, some protein from a couple of the ingredients, fiber, which is amazing, some good bacteria, probiotics for your gut to keep your gut healthy. Um, while I have this set up, it is not going to be ideal. So if you only saw what I was doing to, to mount the camera at this point. Um, so I'm gonna do my best to show you what I'm using and then it's super simple and ridiculously easy, but it's mostly the ingredients that makes it fantastic. I do wanna preface though, in the world of health and wellness, fruit um, is generally good for you in s small amounts. Like, you know, I wouldn't suggest eating it all day long because if you do have any gut imbalances um, going on, the sugar, while it's natural, feeds those imbalances. But blueberries, raspberries, blackberries, those kinds of berries are lower in glycemic index, which means they don't spike your blood sugar as much, they burn slower, so then the sugar's really slower. Um, so with that, I always suggest eating fruit alone or, um, if you're going to eat it with a meal, which sometimes is okay. And I don't know. It just, it depends. I mean, it's not realistic to expect people to not eat fruit with a meal, but eat the fruit first because it, it burns faster than the rest of the food. Otherwise the, if you eat it after, the rest of the food, it ferments in your belly and it's not a good scene after that. So fruit alone or first. In this case, I am mixing it, but it's so, everything else is so light. I think, you know, I haven't had any issues and my gut is quite sensitive. So with that, um, I start off with organic blueberries. Make sure you wash them. I also start off with and you can use whatever if you if you're good with dairy and there's a grass-fed dairy yogurt that you like goat's milk coconut milk this is the coconut milk one this is made with organic coconuts there are some ingredients in here that are considered um, MSG it's not the actual MSG but uh, the, it's derivatives of it basically so if you're super 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 sensitive don't you use the So Delicious. They took a couple of the really bad ones out. I mean, I try to keep it as clean as possible, but I was driving myself bonkers trying to make all of my meals for myself, my kids, my husband, perfect um, for healing the gut or for, you know, the overall wellness. It's just, you just have to do your best. Like, it's impossible to do everything perfectly and just do your best. So anyways, so you need blueberries, coconut milk. I'm using plain because it's less in sugar. Um, organic hemp hearts. Organic chia seeds, which I just keep in this jar. You see, no, just wait a minute. And then this is called Paleo Crunch. And it's essentially cereal, like granola. Sorry, it was an in-frame. Um, but it has no grains, so it's seeds. The ingredients are raw pumpkin seeds, coconut, raw sunflower seeds, figs, honey, coconut oil, baking soda, vanilla, and sea salt. It's delish. They have um, an almond cinnamon one as well. I try, I've noticed that when I don't eat nuts all the time, I feel a lot better because of the, um, some of the, well, I'll do a whole separate video on that, but sometimes an overabundance of nuts can be hard on your body. Um, so I try to stick with seeds more. So this is actually really good. So basically, I will, I don't use this whole whole thing, but just take a little bit of the yogurt. Literally, this is so simplistic. So hopefully you guys can, I don't know, try it. But um, I, I, I never measure anything. <laughs> I'm always making up recipes. So I put like one to two tablespoons of the hemp hearts. Hemp hearts are an excellent, excellent source of protein and fiber. Super really good for you. No sugar, 
pretty easy to digest, um, and they're really small, like super tiny. You can sprinkle them on salads, you can put them in smoothies, you can make, it's super easy. Let me see if I can see it. Sorry, it's not great. They're like little tiny, tiny hulls. Um, and it's a good like vegetarian or meatless way of coming up with some, um, I am not vegetarian, but I have been eating that way lately, just intuitively eating following my cravings. Anyways, it's a good source of um, protein for non-meat options. Also chia seeds, tons of fiber, omegas, um, and protein, along with many other things, calcium too. Um, it's cool because some of these options, it's a lot of bang for your buck as far as um, the, the nutrition, nutrition packed in there. So I always encourage people to kind of look outside the box for things like this to add in because it really does make a difference. It feels good. So um, then I just, I literally will just dump a couple tablespoons of chia seeds and then some of this paleo crunch. For me, this is sweet enough and I'm trying to steer clear of sugar-free, but you can add a little stevia. I like to add cinnamon. I'm gonna show you guys. I like to add cinnamon. Look at, see? Easy peasy. And packed, packed, packed full of a lot of things. I mean, the blueberries are like pretty much the lowest glycemic index berry that you can have, and they actually have super high antioxidants, and they're actually gut healing. There's some properties in it that are gut healing. So, anyways, I wanted to share that with you guys. Keegan and Ella, my children, both eat it, and they love it. Um, sometimes I'll use vanilla yogurt, or the unsweetened vanilla version of that. Try and stay, at, oh, you know what else? I always, I always add, um, one to two hundred billion uh, probiotics to it. Just mix it in there. It's a great way to get your kids some probiotics. They, you know, they sell those three billion like little chewables. I mean, we all need 20 billion plus, 50 billion plus if you ask me. So I try and sneak it into smoothies, into everything possible. So this is a great option. It's super just whole there's nothing crazy and processed in there I'm sorry if that's super simplistic but it's how many times can I say super <laughs> it's it's yummy so give it a try it's a nice spring summer breakfast or even lunch um, I'm gonna be eating it for lunch but I usually eat it for breakfast anyways you guys it's been really fun making these videos I can't wait till I have an actual camera to use but I hope that you enjoyed and let me know what you want to see, please. I need your guidance. Um, I have some really fun ideas as I've been saying, but man, it's so beautiful out. I'm going to show you guys. Just pardon my mess. I can hear my children. They're either screaming because they're hurt or they're laughing. <laughs> we'll just hope for the latter. Look at this. Beautiful day. We were just out garage sailing. Garage sailing? Is that even a term? God, what is wrong with me? We went out last night. We went to Paul Simon. It was so fun. I actually have a clip of me after talking to you guys too, so I'm gonna try and merge the two um, to, to add it to this so you guys can see. But anyways, Blessings to you on this beautiful day. I love these trees. For some reason, they make me happy. It looks like the leaves are clapping. Um, blessings to you guys. I hope that all is well and that you're having a really good Saturday. Um, let me know what you want to see. Um, let me know if you have any questions. Please hit the subscribe button and like this video so that people see it and that was you know that's what I'm trying to do is get hold on greasy I'll be right there I'm trying to get more um, eyes on this platform to try and help people with whatever I can do that's what why we're here right I mean we're all in this together um, 
I will start, if there's products mentioned in my videos, I'm gonna start linking each product in the description box below the video. So you'll have to click around and see what, if you're on your phone or your iPad, I'm not really sure like what arrows or what, but just explore and see if you, you know, and, and click on them if you're interested in buying them or trying them or whatever, just so you guys, it'll make it easier to search for them. So that is it. I hope you're all well. Enjoy. I hope you have really beautiful weather like we do. I'm going to go eat my granola bowl. Should I call it that? Um, and let me know what you want to see. And thank you for all your support. And I will talk to you guys soon. Subscribe, like, and get in touch with me. I hope you guys have a great, great day. Peace.